Welcome to Broadcom Mainframe Topology Installation with SMPE JCL Method Video. This video shows how to get ready for installing mainframe topology on your system using the SMPE JCLs. In this video, you will learn what are the prerequisites for the installation and how to prepare the data that you will need throughout the installation process. Before installing mainframe topology, make sure that you have Java 8 installed on your system. You have IBM DF sort or sync sort installed on your ZOS system. You have a ZFS file system with at least 500 megabytes of free disk space available. You have an available TCP IP port to be assigned for the mainframe topology API server. This is a prerequisite to ensure that the server is accessible from a workstation. And you have designated the user ID that will run the mainframe topology API server STC. This user ID needs access to the USS. If all the prerequisites are met, you can start gathering the data that you will need during the installation process. For this purpose, you can find an installation worksheet in the online documentation of Topology. Access the technical documentation and navigate to the installation worksheet. The installation worksheet is composed of four columns. It provides you with a list of the parameters that you will need to define along with their description. Remember, you can download an editable version. Once you downloaded the installation worksheet, populate the columns with the specific data of your project. It is important that you carefully populate the installation worksheet. In this way, you will have all your data in hand when you will be installing topology. Once you have finished populating your installation worksheet, you can now download the topology installation files from the Broadcom Support Portal. Access the Broadcom Support Portal and navigate to the Download section. Here, you can download the topology installation file, the maintenance file, and an installation validation data set that you can use or validate your installation at the end of this procedure. If you already have SMF data that you want to use for validating the installation, do not download the installation validation data. You have completed the preparation tasks for the installation. You are now ready to install mainframe topology on your system. For more information about the procedure and product, Please refer to the Mainframe Topology Online documentation in Broadcom Tech Docs. Thank you for watching.